It's the first object we found coming from interstellar space, from places beyond our own solar system. For decades, humans have been exploring space, and it's usually us who visit the edges of the solar system and beyond to discover things we can observe with a conventional telescope. The general idea is that things exist in space and we just have to go looking for them. However, the discovery of Oumuamua changed all that. This incredible visitor from deep space has been the subject of plenty of discussion in recent weeks. But now, the James Webb Telescope has just shown the first real image of this space giant and reveal things no one expected. Oumuamua is a strange and interesting object that emerged from the depths of space and captured the attention of the whole world. Once confirmed, everyone wanted to know more about it, as nothing similar had ever been discovered before. This elongated, cigar-shaped visitor, or as some call it, a cosmic needle, arrived in our solar system from a distant realm beyond our own. It's essentially a mysterious traveler venturing through the vastness of space to pay us a fleeting visit. Its particular shape, similar to a thin cigar, makes it unlike anything we've encountered before. This amazing find took place on October 19, 2017, when the only telescope in Hawaii was observing the night sky and revealed the presence of Oumuamua. It was a monumental event as it marked the first time astronomers detected an object from outside our solar system. And the most incredible thing was that it actually reached our solar system and headed straight for Earth. The unexpected arrival of Oumuamua was undoubtedly one of the most significant events that had ever occurred. Astronomers had to investigate it thoroughly, as it seemed to be the key to unlocking the mysteries of our cosmic environment. That's why a real image of this object is so relevant. While imaging is a great thing, scientists have taken steps to leverage the James Webb Space Telescope to study interesting objects as they traverse our solar system. As the first of its kind, this telescope stands out for its exceptional ability to analyze infrared light, making it an invaluable tool for research. Equipped with state-of-the-art technology, high resolution, and extraordinary sensitivity, the James Webb has an unmatched ability to observe objects that are at great distances or that other telescopes can't see. This exceptional sensitivity and power provide a unique opportunity to fully immerse oneself in the mysteries of the objects of interest, to unveil their chemical composition and discover their true nature. All of this will be virtually impossible to study from Earth if we were to simply observe the objects without obtaining a highly detailed image. The James Webb Space Telescope has an advanced infrared camera array that adds additional precision capability when portraying objects of interest. Thanks to its sharp vision, the telescope is able to capture intricate details and nuances, painting a vivid picture of these captivating celestial visitors that venture within our observer range. Although the photographs obtained can be complete in a single shot, the telescope can combine hundreds and even thousands of images to even create a mega image that shows every little detail you want to see. By being able to capture fainter, more elusive aspects of these interesting objects, the Webb Telescope allows scientists to conduct groundbreaking research and unlock secrets hidden deep in the cosmos. But that's just the beginning. The Webb Telescope expands the frontiers of exploration, allowing scientists to peer into the depths of space at magnitudes and levels of brightness that were previously unattainable opening the door to truly fascinating scientific investigations and pushing the boundaries of our knowledge and understanding of the universe. This is why the James Webb Telescope was chosen instead of the Pan-SARS-1 Telescope to carry out this research. This doesn't mean that the Pan-SARS-1 Telescope is not good at what it does. They're just quite different. The University of Hawaii's Pan-SARS-1 Telescope is a remarkable astronomical instrument located atop Haleakala on the beautiful island of Maui, Hawaii. With a diameter of 1.8 meters, it plays a vital role in the ambitious Pan-STARRS project. A collaboration between institutions including the University of Hawaii, Hawaii Institute for Astronomy, the MIT, the Maui Lincoln Laboratory, and the Maui International High Performance Applications Corporation. At its core, the Pan-STARRS-1 telescope is designed to capture wide-field astronomical images, offering a broad perspective of space. The primary mission of the Pan-SARS-1 telescope is to conduct comprehensive surveys of the night sky, capturing the beauty of the heavens at optical wavelengths. 
From distant galaxies to nebulae, to the elusive comets and asteroids, this telescope tirelessly explores the cosmos, documenting the wonders that populate our vast universe. One outstanding facet of the Pan-STARRS-1 telescope is its dedication to the study of near-Earth objects. This ambitious project focuses on systematically scanning the entire sky north of declination minus 47.5, looking for objects close to our planet that may represent a potential danger. In fact, that's why it was the first to discover Oumuamua. It wasn't specifically looking for that particular object, but was simply doing its job and, in the process, came across Oumuamua. When an object is detected at orbit in the Sun, it's normally classified as an asteroid. So Oumuamua was seen as one, due to its peculiar appearance and behavior. It appeared to be a strange rock traversing the solar system, which justified its classification. However, as the collected data were processed and analyzed, it became clear that this mysterious interstellar traveler defied all expectations. It abruptly altered its trajectory, raising intriguing questions about its true nature. But this is where the thing became increasingly urgent due to the rapid speeds at which Oumuamua crossed our solar system. Researchers faced a challenge of downing portions. They only had 11 days to gather as much info as possible about this peculiar visitor before it got too far away to study. With each passing day, the opportunity to collect data was shrinking. The need for efficient analysis was growing as any delay could impede their understanding of this extraordinary phenomenon. NASA, known for making effective use of time, used powerful resources to shed light on Oumuamua's characteristics. The large telescope, located in Chile, was the formidable instrument charged with the responsibility of accurately measuring the object's dimensions, capturing its orbit, and investigating its color and brightness. Every detail of the surface and structure of this primordial rock was crucial considering that it was a completely new and unimaginable object. It was mandatory for the researchers to capture as much data as possible, so they could process it and study it in depth in the future. However, Oumuamua stood out by lacking a coma, which is the atmosphere and dust that surrounds comets as they break apart. Several telescopes focus on it for three nights to try to find out more about it before it disappeared. Although there is no tangible evidence to directly support Oumuamua's extraterrestrial origins, the exceptional characteristics of this object generate intriguing theories and imaginative possibilities. Based on the first real image of Oumuamua, Neil deGrasse Tyson argued that its unique shape and elongated dimensions indicate one single purpose. In addition, its unusual trajectory and considerable speed suggest the existence of a possible propulsion system beyond what we know. The fact that Oumuamua comes from another star system raises questions about the possibility of abandoned civilizations in the universe. Speculation revolves around the notion that Oumuamua could be a probe sent by an extraterrestrial civilization to investigate and study other star systems. In addition, the lack of a coma or tail, which is often associated with comets, adds to the mystery surrounding its composition and origin. Oumuamua's peculiar rotational motion which suggests that it's not a natural object, further stirs the imagination as to how a spacecraft might behave during a journey involving complex spins. Thank you so much for watching the video. Remember to like and subscribe.